Hey guys, we're Any Wilderness here hanging out at Chateau de Ivre in Western Mass here to introduce our new bushcraft channel. We're going to be posting a series of videos introducing the skills of bushcraft. Our goal is to make this accessible to anyone, whether you're a hiker, a backpacker, a hunter, or someone who just wants to really learn to experience the outdoors. We're going to start with building your first bushcraft kit, the, uh, the sharps, tarps, containers, and combustors you'll need to to get started and, and how to do that really on a budget, really inexpensively. Um, this isn't skiing, this isn't backpacking, this isn't going to be another drain on your uh, on the outdoorsman's wallet, but really just something that's cheap and fun and easy and hopefully will help lighten your uh, the load you have to carry when you, when you do head out into the woods. After we go through how to assemble your under $100 bushcraft kit, we're going to go through the skills of fire building, shelter building, hunting, fishing, um, cooking on an open fire, the things that we hunt for and fish for and, and forage for. Yep, we're going to go through some foraging, a little bit of uh, wild plant and tree identification, a little bit of mushroom identification. Our goal is to get you really comfortable out in the woods. And, and you know, using the tools that, that go with bushcraft, with axes and saws, and the basics of how to use them safely, how to maintain them, keep them sharp. Um, how to use different sorts of ignition sources for your fire, you know, um, see a lot of ferro rods, those work great, we'll be using ferro rods quite a bit, but also just things like lighters and matches and how to effectively start a fire in the woods with, with your kind of common fire starting devices you find around. Yeah. And, and, and hopefully getting into more, more primitive fire starting methods of friction fire and bow drills and sort of any way you can possibly start a fire in the woods, we'll, we'll start those fires and, and keep them going. The goal is to make you comfortable doing it really in any situation with whatever materials you have around you. Yeah, so that there's just less in your backpack when you do head out and, uh, and knowledge weighs nothing is a real core principle of bushcraft. Absolutely. We're really into no more, carry less. The more skills you have, the more confident you are in the woods, the more you can rely on yourself, your skills and knowledge, and uh, a few simple tools that are indispensable in the woods. And it's a real, it's a real wonderful feeling of comfort when, when you know what you're doing, when you head out into the woods and it's not this scary place you have to fight until you can get back to civilization, where it's a, a welcoming and warm place where you feel at home. And um, comfort is really king. Uh, how to make yourself more comfortable when you head out into the woods so that, uh, Ray Mears says, if you're roughing it, you're doing something wrong. And that's a principle I really take to heart. And uh, I like to smooth it, and I'd like to like to show all of you guys how to how to smooth it too. Thank you. In addition to our videos on the channel, you can follow us at newwilderness.com. 
we're going to be posting reviews of products that we like and that we really highly recommend. Also a, a text-based version of, of the, uh, the lesson from the video so that if that's more your learning style, you'll be able to just read the steps as opposed to trying to, to watch us do it and then remember that when you go out to practice it yourself. Our website is also where you can find the list of courses that we'll be providing this spring. We're looking forward to seeing a number of you alongside with us. Also, you can follow me on Instagram, and it's n underscore e underscore wilderness, any wilderness on Instagram, and we'll put that, uh, put that tag up at the end of the video. Awesome, guys. Get bushcrafting. We'll see you in the woods.